one sting, and he was dead. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down the most hazardous animals, bugs, and fish in the land and territorial waters of the United States. Oh gosh, this is so bad. Oh my gosh. Oh. Number 10, sharks. After the 1975 film Jaws, the world has really been in fear of sharks, and that is understandable. The U.S. has sustained more recorded shark attacks over the centuries than any other nation in the world. Many of the vicious incidents have happened off the state of Florida, with Hawaii in second place. A lot of people can surf here their whole life and never even notice a shark. That doesn't mean that the shark's not nearby. Yet, even with all that, humans are still far more likely to be struck by lightning than be attacked by these marine animals. Between 1959 and 2010, lightning took 1,970 lives, compared to sharks with 26. So, while sharks are fearsome, they rarely fatally threaten humans. Yeah, there's just something about shark. Number 9. Cougars. Whether we're talking mountain lions, pumas, panthers, or cougars, big cats are a threatening sight with their large teeth and claws, agile movements, and silent stalking. Like all cats, the puma has superb night vision. With these weapons in its arsenal, cougars are known to attack large prey, such as elk and deer, usually ambushing their victims. When the cougar pulls down in the winter and starts feeding off the mule deer herd, uh, they don't know the difference between a, a horse and a deer. It's all food to them. And humans count as prey, even if attacks are relatively rare. In the past 100 years, there have been 126 attacks by cougars on people, 27 of which were fatal. But despite their hunting skills, they rarely attack humans. Statistically, it's more likely that you'll be killed by an accident in the bath or being hit by lightning. Cougars and other big cats are not to be messed with. Many of these unfortunate incidents have historically happened to children. Number 8. Alligators Considering that the American alligator is third in the world for the highest bite force at 2,125 pounds per square inch, they aren't to be taken lightly. Faced with the prospect of extinction around the middle of this century because of overhunting, alligator numbers have been steadily increasing since they were officially protected in 1967. Mostly found in marshes and swamps in the southern U.S., Florida, Louisiana, and the Carolinas are thriving locations for this reptile. So much so that since 1948, when state records began, Florida has recorded 442 unprovoked gator attacks, with 26 being fatal. With a bite three times more powerful than a lion, it's better to retreat than risk injury. Alligators often strike when a human gets too close to a body of water. Water is their element. Stealth, their method of attack. Their reptilian siblings, the American crocodile, very rarely attack people. In 2014, two Floridian swimmers were given the unfortunate honor of being the first humans to get bitten by a croc. Number seven, bears. It is the old bear, one who is struggling for survival, and an aggressive one at that, who is the one that you must be very careful of. Bears of all kinds are animals you don't want to mess with under any circumstances. After all, they are very powerful and have one of the strongest bites in the animal kingdom. Brains and brawn have no doubt helped these robust animals survive and flourish in such a broad range of environments around the globe. In addition, bears have a vast array of adaptations and special skills to call on to assist them in their daily lives. North America is home to three bear species the American black bear, the grizzly bear, and the polar bear. The northern states have the highest density of bears, Alaska in particular. Bears rarely attack people, but when they do, it's usually mothers protecting their young. According to the National Park Service, at another prime bear location, Yellowstone National Park, the risk of a grizzly attack is around 1 in 2.7 million visits, with eight fatalities since 1872. But nothing announces the season like a mighty grizzly waking from hibernation. Number six, spiders. It is not what you want to find in your home. Ooh. Sometimes the creepy crawlies of the wildlife realm are more of a threat than the big ones. When it comes to spiders, the U.S. has two species that cause big-time issues, the black widow and the brown recluse. Because of their size, people often accidentally stumble upon them, experiencing their wrath with a venom-filled bite. One of the more common ways that people get bit is they're in clothing or clutter, 
uh, inside shoes. While very rare for people to perish from their venom, serious wounds and symptoms can happen, such as severe pain, vomiting, and skin ulcers. This is why medical attention is needed on suspicion of being bitten by a venomous spider. It's estimated that there are three fatalities per year from the bites, usually children or those with a compromised immune system. A bite could range from a painful blister to a more serious hospital visit. Number five, snakes. And there's the little beauty. In a country with 22 recognized species of venomous snakes, it can be a struggle to avoid them. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, an estimated 7,000 to 8,000 people are bitten by these reptiles each year, with five perishing as a result. And one of the most potent is the rattlesnake. The eastern diamondback rattlesnake can administer significant amounts of venom through their bite. One bite will dispatch their prey. Another common attacker of people is the copperhead. With its camouflage scales and habit of striking when threatened, people tend to get bitten after accidentally disturbing them. And not even the water is safe from snakes, what with the potently venomous coral snake. So keep your eyes peeled for this triple color threat and remember the rhyme. Red to yellow, kill a fellow. Red to black, venom lack. Number four, livestock. Cows might look sweet and kind with their gentle mooing, but deep inside is there a darkness bubbling below the surface. Oh, yeah, the officer thought he had the cow cornered, but nope, the suspect was not going down without a fight. After all, they take out humans each year, albeit accidentally for the most part. Greg Nolan knows. She, she's a little, she can be a little bit psychotic. But he takes care of his cow, Belvia. That's in spite of her almost killing him last month. According to CDC data, between 2003 and 2008, there were 2,334 deaths on farms. Out of those, cows were either the primary or secondary cause of those lethal incidents in 108 cases. For those preferring equestrian hobbies to farming, horses can be just as dangerous. Between 1993 and 2004, horses were involved in the deaths of 43 people in New Mexico alone. Number three, dogs. He's aggressive towards people. <laughs> He's trying to attack. He's trying to get at them. Man's best friend? Not always. Millions of people are bitten by dogs every year, with up to 13,000 needing hospitalization. According to the CDC, between 2011 and 2021, there were 468 fatal attacks by dogs, making it on average 43 per year. It's okay. Good girl. As for which is the most dangerous breed? According to the World Animal Foundation, which examined data from 2010 to 2021, that would be pit bull type breeds which include Staffordshire Bull Terrier and American Bully. Far in second place is Rottweilers. Forbes, who examined data from the Wilderness and Environmental Medicine Journal, discovered the state with the most dog fatalities was Alaska, with Idaho a distant second. Number two, stinging insects. Size doesn't matter, especially when it comes to how dangerous a creature is. To defend themselves, they will, using their powerful sting. According to the CDC, between 2000 and 2017, the U.S. had 1,109 fatalities from wasp, hornet, and bee stings, with an average of 62 per year. But if you thought that was a while ago and newer data would be better, it only gets a bit worse. And hornets are intensely predatory gorging themselves on other insects, like this praying mantis. When they examined 2011 to 2021, there were 788 fatalities, with an average of 72 per year. Of course, a couple of years ago, giant Asian hornets were the big talking point. These giants are the world's largest hornet, five times the size of the average honeybee. With an incredible sting and being able to attack multiple times, it stated that a small colony could take out a 150 pound animal. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into settings and switch on your notifications. Number one, Deer. This was no bad. Deer can be found all across the United States, making them a prime target for hunters and a nightmare for drivers. According to CDC data that was analyzed in 2016, deer have taken an average of 120 human lives each year, making them one of the most dangerous mammals in the world. Deer have captured our imaginations and have found their way into our literature, 
and legends. There have been cases in the states of deer that have taken the life of a hunter by using their sharp antlers in defense. Beyond direct attack, in 2019, Utah State University reported that there were 58,622 annual incidents involving collisions between vehicles and deer, with 440 resulting in humans perishing. So while they look sweet, be careful on the road in the presence of the U.S.'s biggest animal danger. But as deer populations rise, researchers believe attacks are becoming more frequent. The reason we have more deer attacks on humans is because we've got record numbers of deer, record numbers of humans coming into contact, which increases the likelihood of these sorts of problems. What animal do you most fear? Let us know in the comments. Most people think of deer and you think Bambi. Well, deer can actually be very, very dangerous. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from Watch Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.